Hello, Yube, Demon Warrior, Aizen, Sarah, RJ. Let's see. Peyton, Shiny, Yellowtail, Carl, Sang, Life Eternal. Welcome in, welcome in. Welcome, gamers and musicians. Or both, or maybe neither. Maybe you're neither? Neither? Either way, I hope we're all going to have an amazing time watching some trombone champ. How am I? I am doing great. Thank you for asking. I, well, first of all, let me ask you all a question. A very important question that is very relevant to my current situation. Not, you know, in the trombone sense. But something that I had, that had occurred right before stream. It's a little unrelated. But it's, it is currently on my mind. When you're filling out, here we go. When you're filling out an online form, and you see the button next. Do you expect there to be another page on the form? Or do you think the next button will submit the form? What are your thoughts? You would assume there to be another page, right? I would think, I would think that the end of the form would say done or submit or complete, but I was shocked, flabbergasted, blindsided by this form, and I'm I'm still shaken by it. <laughs> oh my gosh! Right next means another page. Submit is submit. Gosh, I felt so bad. I just I clicked it and it said thank you for your response, and I thought no. <laughs> oh my gosh. But anyway, that's how I am today. <laughs> I hope everyone else's day is going a lot better than a uh, missubmitted form. <laughs> oh my gosh. I mean, aside from that, I've had an amazing day. That's not to say that the form, the whole form fiasco ruined my day. It did not. It, it did make me feel a little, little bit bad. I felt a little silly for not having taken any sort of precautionary measure. I was not expecting this website to not have good UX. I was very disappointed <laughs> in the website. I, you would think, you know, I, I'm not going to say what website it was, but it, it was, I just was not expecting that sort of user experience from this website. <laughs> Did I enjoy the art exhibition? That's right. I went to an art exhibition yesterday. It was like a local artist's showcase. And it was really nice. Yeah, it was It was about women in, in the modern age. And it was really great. Very contemplative. I really liked it. And we got to meet and talk with the artists that were there. And, and read about what inspired their work. And it was really nice. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but yeah, I, I, I've had an interesting past 
first of all, hour with the whole form thing. But I've had a wonderful past couple of days, and I hope you all are excited for some trombone champ. So whether, you know, you're a gamer, a rhythm gamer, a musician, maybe you play trombone, maybe you don't. I hope we have a very exciting and interesting day today. <laughs> okay, shall we get started? Who's ready? Who's ready to play some trombone? I know I am. <laughs> I know, oh gosh, who else played this? Aoi played this game. Who else in Prison Project has played this game? Is it just me and Aoi so far? That's what I know of right now. I don't know, I'm nervous. Aoi is really good at rhythm games. So, who knows? But I've sat in front of a brass section before. They can be very loud. <laughs> So maybe, who knows, maybe it rubs off on me. So, Sara, Sara's played it. Okay, so Sara and Aoi, how did they do? I'm nervous. <laughs> oh, gosh. Here we go. Let's, let's get this party started, shall we? <gasps> yes, I'm sure. Why does it say no? Cancel! <laughs> yes, I'm sure. How's the volume, everyone? Sara had tech issues? No! Oh yeah, I've definitely... So oh. it, comes to pass. it does seem like more of like a meme game, Ages I agree. Ages after the twin vessels were forged, a new soul appears. Is this the lore that all trombone players Brave have to learn before they learn their instrument? One day you will stand before two baboons. Baboons? Oh! Oh! Is this like a music theory lesson? Is this... One day is this real? You will rend the very fabric that binds this land. Is this why brass players behave in the way that they do? <gasps> Bass clef and treble clef? What about alto clef? You must Where is... What? Why? What is this alto clef Touch erasure? Trombone, brave soul. Oh. And you okay. Yet oh. What is this? Champ. This is real? This is lore? I've never had any... I've never had anything like this with a viola. Welcome to Trombone Champ. Choose play to play the main game. Okay, let's do it. You're glad your director changed you off of trombone? Oh my gosh. Okay, let's go. Top Josh says, did you know that very few rock or metal musicians read music or know music theory? I, I, I firmly believe that you don't need to know music theory to be a musician, but I think it really does help. Choose your tromboner, okay. Oh, they have names. <gasps> oh, the hair! Whoa! Interesting. Soda. <laughs> oh my gosh, I like that name. Let's go with Soda. <laughs> you, could, you can get other instruments, brass. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, here we go. Let's go with Soda. Can we get a, can we get a round of applause for Soda? Oh. A world of music awaits you, but first, let's start with a warm-up. Okay. <gasps> oh, look at this! Tears, Spunk, Dudes, Slides, and Fury. Any trombone players want to confirm that this is, like, proper trombone terminology? <gasps> I'm so scared! Okay, let me, let me, let me make sure that my mouse has proper space to move. Although my mouse pad isn't like long, it's round. Move the mouse forward and back to move the slide. Line up the dot with the note lines. Oh my gosh, okay. Press the left mouse button or any letter key to toot. Use a <laughs> toot. <laughs> Using the keyboard may be easier on your wrist. Any uh, pro trombone champ players want to give some strats for the game? If you play well, you build combos and increase your champ meter. This is how you get big points. Oh, yeah. Here we go. I saw someone rig an actual trombone to use it as the controller. I've seen that! Where it's like... Where it's like sound-based. I've seen that. Have two letter keys ready? Oh, my God. I'll do space. Is that okay? Or I'll do... I don't know. Oh, gosh. Most of all, have fun. I would agree. That is that is a, a pro musician... Like, like a pro gamer moment. Pro musician moment. Okay, here we go. Okay. Okay. 
I'm also ready to laugh. <gasps> oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Ah! <laughs> it's reversed! messed up that last arpeggio. I'm sorry. Oh, my gosh. Oh, oh. Okay. All right. It's reversed. I have to bring it closer to me to go higher. Oh, my gosh. How's my intonation, everyone? Oh, I like this track. Oh, gosh. Oh, ah! oh my gosh. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh. Carnegie Hall. You better look out. I'm on my way. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah, here we go. <laughs> uh, okay, we modulated a little bit, okay. Da, da, da. Oh, oh, no, I was a little black, I'm sorry. It's a, it's a stylistic choice. I did a little glissando into that note. I, I don't know if you all noticed. No, I got a B. That'll hardly get me into Juilliard. Oh, no. <laughs> I think I might switch away from inverted. I Unless that's like a pro trombone champ. I don't want to learn the instrument incorrectly. I know so close to A. I wasn't paying attention to the lyrics. I was trying to get my intonation correctly. B for best. Oh, my gosh. Nah, we don't need to retry. That's okay. That'll hardly get me into Juilliard. Do you all know what Juilliard is? It's a music school, if I remember correctly. Really hard to get into. It says Juilliard, a music school in New York City, New York. Oh. <laughs> okay, uh, what happens now? Do we have to get a certain score? It's the most prestigious music school. Oh my gosh, they have Ina Kleiner. Oh my gosh. Trap mix. Oh. <gasps> Stop! That's so cool! Or do you think I should go in order? Odd Lang Syne. They have so many classics! Oh man. We should start by difficulty, right? We'll go easy. Zarathustra? Oh my gosh! They have so many cool stuff. Oh my gosh! I love this waltz! You want to earn toots to unlock collectibles. I think we should just do the faves, right? We should do some classics. <gasps> Skip to my loom! Oh my gosh! Can you all tell I'm excited? Hold on, hold on. We should go... We're going to go in, in difficulty order, I think. Okay. Let's see. The first part of this piece titled Sunrise became famous after being used in the film A 2001 A Space Odyssey. Let's just go for it. I'm scared. Wait, I told myself I wasn't going to do... Let any to switch from inverted. Oh, no. Or we can just keep the challenge going. Let me not use... Oh, my gosh. Oh, no, I'm not ready. Okay. Ba, ba. Oh, not bad, not bad. Sorry, <laughs> the timpanist is probably looking at me like, Are you okay? Did you eat something bad? Da <laughs> oh no. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, did you see like the ornamentation I did there? I purposefully was a little bit flat there for a little bit. All on purpose, right? It's all on purpose. Oh, did you hear that? Somebody tooted. Woo! <laughs> Maybe you can do a little bit of vibrato there. <laughs> Do trombone players do vibrato? <laughs> Yay! Oh, no! We're always so close to A, but not quite. That's okay. <laughs> this is my first time playing trombone, so that's okay. Yay! <laughs> oh, 
my gosh. I know the character really makes it funny. Vibrato with brass. I don't know. I'm not. I'm a string player. So I wouldn't know anything about brass. How to play a brass instrument. B for brass. Can I, speaking of brass players, I've always had very interesting experiences with brass players. I find that brass musicians are always the most chaotic musicians. Mm -hmm. Do you all agree? Do you all have, is it a universal experience? I find that the brass sections that I've interacted with are always very, very loud. Not musically, like the people are. They're, re it's re they're really fun. Like, they're, they're always so energetic and really loud and really chaotic. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not against band kids. Like I said, I think that's really fun. Yeah, but uh, the brass sections that I've interacted with, they're always super, like, silly and chaotic and really loud. Mm -hmm. Must be the lung capacity. Oh, my gosh. I don't know. Percussion, I feel like I've had, like, a mixed bag. The percussionists that I've met are either also chaotic or the most chill people I, I've met. And I think the chill percussionists I've met are also the ones who play like a drum kit, like in a, like in a band or something. Mm -hmm. But yeah. <laughs> Your friend plays brass and is very chaotic and a nerd. Oh, <laughs> see, oh my gosh. But yeah, I don't know. I, 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 I really like brass as a section. I, I think people who play brass instruments are pretty cool. I don't know. I like band. If I, but if I was in a band, I think I'd choose either flute. And by that, I also would like to try playing the piccolo. And then maybe percussion. I think percussion is really cool. Because you get to try to play all these different kinds of instruments. Mm -hmm. I've also found that the woodwind musicians that I've interacted are, are very chill. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, see, but I feel like percussionists are a different kind of chill than woodwinds. Yeah. I feel like the percussionists kind of chill is like, oh yeah, I'm in a, I'm in a rock band kind of chill. Like, ooh, you know what I mean? <laughs> I guess that makes sense. You have a lot of like drummers out there. So maybe, who knows? <laughs> okay, here we go. Let's do... Ina Kleina! Oh my gosh! I, I played this before, but I've never done a trap mix before, so let's see how it goes. The first trombone was invented in... Oh my gosh! Is that real? <laughs> oh, here we go. I like how there's a Mozart in the back. I'm so distracted by his handsomeness. He's back! Oh my gosh! He's probably rolling around in his grave. <laughs> oh gosh, I don't know if I gotta be. I. Oh wow! <laughs> oh my gosh! Ina Kleina was hard, though. There were some really intense uh, jumps there. 
And hello! Welcome in for those who are just stopping by. I'm gonna change the settings. I, I can't do that, the inverted anymore. Not inverted. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Chunky, thank you so much for celebrating your eighth month as idol coach. And no worries, please enjoy lurking. Should we try it again? We should practice. We should practice the non-inverted. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh goodness. Here we go. I don't know if my power is unleashed now. Oh my goodness. C's for cool. I like that. I like that. A is for ombature. Is that is it with an A? Oh, I forgot. I forgot. No, I'm used to it now. Oh, gosh. I'm used to it now. Let, let's just retry it. Let me practice in the beginning, too. Oh, wait, where's my key? There we go. Okay, it is now not inverted. I have to keep that in mind. Oh, gosh. Da, da, da. <laughs> da, 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 Okay, now I'm used to it. It's a little bit better. Oh, a little sharp. That's okay. <laughs> oh, gosh. I'm, nor I'm used to going down on the note there. Wow. Da 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 da. <laughs> Oh, is there like a latency thing I should be doing? Like a latency adjustment? I just realized. <laughs> I'm doing great with a non-inverted. Oh, I'm glad. Oh, there we go. B this time. That's good. Oh, there is a latency thing. Should I do that? I mean, I don't, we're not taking this too seriously. We're just trying to have fun and learn how to play uh, trombone. Oh my gosh, there was a huge difficulty jump. What happened there? B and a half. B sharp? <laughs> it, which is just C. Half step up, up, above B is C, is C. Oh gosh. Here we go. The blue Danube waltz. Here we go. Good thing I'm not allergic to bees. That is true. I am not allergic to bees. I should do a lag calibration. Okay, let's do that. Let's... Why not? Why not? Since we're choosing... We're choosing... Our settings already. So might as well do our... How do you... Oh, timing tool. Here we go. I think it's fine. I think the 10 that it was at is fine. See how different it, it is each time? Oh. I think 10 is fine. We're not gonna worry about it. We're just here to have fun. Free improvisation? Oh my gosh, I don't have a trombone. Maybe that'd be really useful. Here we go. There are more trombones in, on Earth than there are humans. Uh-oh! Who out there is a trombone? Who's lying? Uh-oh. Da 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 
da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da da I like that octave. <laughs> oh my gosh. I got champ though. That was cool. That was pretty cool, right? Majestic. <laughs> I'm glad you think so. Oh my gosh. Oh wow. What did you all think of that one? You know what they should do? They should make like a viola champ. Like a DLC called Viola Champ. And what, what were the devs name? Holy wow. Is that what it was? You all need to make a, a viola DLC. Of all the instruments, I think viola is a great one to make a video game about. <laughs> oh my gosh, let's see. Oh, of course, Borgerland got to do the Star Spangled Banner. Here we go. Sounds like we need to email them. Oh my gosh, the highest note playable on trombones is so high-pitched that only certain bats can hear it. Echo location. <gasps> Uh, oh, oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight o'er the red I'm streaming and the rockets! Oh gosh! I can't do it! Da 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 da! I have to go down and off da da! Game proof through the night that our flag was still there. Oh, say does that star. I like the, the air horn came in at the right time. Da da da! Or the land of the free! The home of the burgers. See, there's a burger in the back. Woo! Oh, we could have. We were so close to getting it A. <laughs> oh, welcome to the voice of a bass where you can never sing higher than a C flat. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Woohoo! That was fun. We got 338 toots. You think we have enough to to spend in the store? Baboon? Baboon? Play is play the story? What's the story mode? Okay. My card collection. What's a turd? Oh, oh no, is this a gotcha game? Oh my gosh. Nobody told me this was gonna be a gotcha game. Uh-oh. Sure. Let's let's just get one. For now. Oh no, it is a gotcha game! Oh no. Oh! Oh! Open! Oh! Oh yeah. A Richard Strauss! Okay. Slide. That's a that's a piece of the instrument. Immutable. 
1864 to 1949. I like how there's music history. Oh, glissando! So they do have glissando in, in brass music. I have a question. I'm raising my hand. I have a question for those uh, brass players out there. Uh, is trombone one of the instruments where they don't actually play the notes that are on the sheet music? Do they play? Do you play in concert pitch? I always find that very confusing. It's kind of cute how they add elements, elements of history. I agree. I agree. I think it's really nice. What do you all think? Should we, should we spend the rest of our toots? I don't know. You all feel lucky? <laughs> Oh my gosh. I don't know. I'm gonna have to search up which instruments do concert pitch. Save the toots or toot away. Hmm. If there's anything else, I, I don't know. Let's see. Let's see if there's anything else we can use them on. What is baboon? What is baboon mode? Oh! Oh! Trombones play in C. They see a C, they play a C. So they don't play in concert pitch. Or, hold on. Let's see. Concert pitch is the pitch reference to which a group of musical instruments are tuned for a performance. Because I know that it's really weird. Like, whenever you look at a score for an orchestra that has, like, winds and brass, some of the winds and brass are in a different key, it looks like. It's really weird. They, like, transpose their music. I don't understand it. I don't understand the, the concept. Does anyone know why that exists? Yeah, it's really interesting. Okay, let's go. A baboon is a very naughty monkey. What, the first rule of trombone club, don't talk about the baboon. Explore the forgotten chamber that houses the treble clef toot vessel. I don't think I'm ready for that. I don't think I'm emotionally ready for that. Okay, here we go. Let's keep practicing, and then maybe we'll be ready for the baboon. We should do Sugar Plum Fairy! Uh, anyone a big fan of Chike? I love me some Chike. My favorite piece. Oh. Let's, 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 I'll continue the conversation later. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, gosh. You know how they have the automaton? They should have the Rita tone. Oh, these so well! Those jumps are crazy! That's two times we got the champ. Whoa, no! We're so close. I should actually focus. I should try to actually, you know, because I'm trying to, I'm just aiming for close enough, right? We're just trying to get used to everything. I don't know. Who knows? Woo! We're getting really close. Skip to my loo. Okay, we should do this one. Square dance. You dance in a square. Oh my gosh. Let Rita get an A. No, it's okay. I'm not good at rhythm games, so I'm not particularly expecting much to... Oh. It takes over 3,000 tons of brass to produce a single trombone. Interesting. 
Oh yeah. Da 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 I want to see an Osu player play this game. I'm square dancing. Look at me. Interesting arrangement. <laughs> I've gotten so many X's, this is so bad. <laughs> I don't know, but I don't think I'm gonna get a B on this one. Oh, he jumped up an octave, oh gosh! <laughs> I may not have good technique, but my style is there. <laughs> oh, I don't even think I got a C on that one. Oh, hey! I got a B! Not bad, not bad. Octave jumps really are the ultimate flex. I agree. Scarbird? <gasps> Baboons! This looks oddly suspicious, but we should do that. Rosa Mood. Beer Barrel Polka. Let's do Baboons. I'm a little... Look at it. Look at the look at the description. Baboons. Baboon! B is for Baboon! Let's go! In real life, there are over nine songs that feature a trombone. This is true! This is correct. Yes. Oh... Ooh, nice. Baboon. Baboon. Wow. This is tough. Wow. <laughs> Baboon. Wow! Baboon! Boon! Baboon! Sing with me! Boon! Baboon! Baboon! Oh! Oh! Interesting! Okay! <laughs> oh! Thank you. Thank you. I set my delay to 30? I thought I set it to... <gasps> my first A! Oh my gosh! Whoa! I thought I set it to 10. Maybe, maybe that's why. Perfectos, nices, okays, mez, and nasties. Oh my gosh! So yeah, it turns out B isn't for baboon after all. Let's see. Let's let's go back to my timing. I thought I set it to 10. Yeah, see? 10 milliseconds. Is that what it MS stands for? Free improvisation. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Here we go. <laughs> mm -mm -mm -mm. I have to find my note. Okay, I... I, I, I don't know how to play trombone, so I don't know if I can do this properly. Wait, hold on. There's a song I want to play, but I don't know if I can play. Mm, okay, sure, I'll go there. I don't know how to... I, I, okay, let's see. Interesting, okay. Hmm, let me think of a different song. Hmm. Hmm, 
I'm thinking. I'm thinking. What song would be good? Oh, I know. Interesting. <laughs> Maybe I'm not good at the trombone yet. What should I play? Oh, somebody gave a good idea. I'll do it. Mm. I don't know if I can. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I need she music for this. <laughs> what else? What else? Uh, let me think. Let me think. I can't do it. Let me. Let me. Let me think. I was gonna. I was gonna do Luto's favorite song, but I couldn't figure out how to how to play it. What else? Mm, do -do 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 -do. What's a What's an iconic song? What is an iconic song? There's spray every time the trombone is plays. No! Oh. So there's two. We have two octaves to play. <laughs> mm. The Law and Order opening? Oh, I could. Oh, gosh. Oh, I'm getting a phone call. It says telemarketer. No, thank you. I'm playing the trombone. <laughs> This spittle is part of what makes a good trombone, really. Oh my gosh. Don't they have like a, those like string things with a cloth at the end that they throw into their, into their instrument and they pull out the other end? Okay, we'll come back when, we're, when we feel more inspired. Let's see. All right, here we go. Let's play a few more songs and go into baboon mode. Beethoven's fifth! I don't know, I feel like... <gasps> Entertainer! Scott Joplin! Okay, here we go. It takes 1,000 workers a full year to produce a single trombone. Is this real? Is that a real fact? Oh. Hello, JR... J9RQ. Welcome to the stream. da 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 Bum. Da 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 I know about, I know this song because of Starfall. We've talked about Starfall before. William Tell, Stars and Stripes, Trombone, Fuerte. Oh my gosh, we should do the hardest one. Commonly performed by mariachi bands. This is the National Dance of Mexico. This dance represents a courtship ritual and absolutely slaps. Let's go. Yeah, I did Starfall. Yeah, it helped me a lot with my English language skills. Oh. oh, wow, I didn't realize it was a star right away. Okay. <gasps> da -da, da -da. Oh, wow.
The last note. Let's see. Let's let's see how he did. Okay, not bad for the most difficult song. That was fun. Trombone fuerte. Oh, merengue. A fast-paced Latin American dance originating from the Dominican Republic. Sure. English is I, English is technically my first language. Yes, I learned it alongside another language, so I I, I consider it my oh the I don't know this song. Wow. Da 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 da. -da. Oh, wow. Wow! Da 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 I wish I knew the song. Da 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 Wow! It's going by so fast! Wow! I like this! I feel like a worm! I, I learned Cebuano and English alongside of each other. So I, I can't say one is my first language over the other. I think they're both my first language. But English was the one that I, I guess was, I was better at. And then it eventually just became my main language. And now, the, really the only language I can speak on a fluent level. Um, I can speak a little bit of Japanese, but not fluently. Um, but I can still understand Cebuano. I just can't speak it, if that makes sense. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, track select. Are we ready? Do you think I'm ready for the baboons? What do you think? Am I ready for the baboons? Flight of the Valkyrie. Oh my gosh. What is that, Wagner? Do they have it here? Let's see. William Tell. Oh my gosh. Let's do it. We're ready for baboons? Okay, we'll do baboons after this one. Oh. There's the horses! There they are! <laughs> oh wow! Wow! I have a very different perspective on this song! As a string musician who's played this song before, this is a very new side of this song that I've never experienced! Wow. I've experienced that that passage with other with the what sixteenth notes or something. 
Wow, this is a, this is new. Okay. Wow. Maybe I maybe one day I will play a brass instru instrument. Wow! 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 Why is the baboon one the only one I got an A on? Maybe that that's a sign that we're ready for the baboons. So we should go. Who's ready for the baboons? Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. It must be a sign. That's what I'm thinking. Oh my gosh. I was going to say something earlier, but I I forgot what I was going to say. It was something about Tchaikovsky, but I cannot remember for the life of me what I was going to say. Oh well, that's okay. Oh, I was going to mention my favorite Tchaikovsky piece. I would have to say... Oh gosh, I, I, I'd have to say it's probably from... Oh wow, I like the pas de deux. The pas de deux from Swan Lake. That is probably my... My, uh, my favorite piece. Or movement? <laughs> Oh my gosh, it, it's one of the songs. I, I started making a playlist, but I haven't shared it yet because I want to add more to it. But um, it's one of the songs that just makes me very emotional. Mm -hmm. Okay, here we go. I like how you called him Chike like a close personal friend. Me and I don't know if other musicians do this, but when I was when I played in a quartet, so I, I me and some of my friends, we did a quartet when I was younger. We would go around and we would we would play at like people's weddings or at, at local like uh, events and things like that. And so we had like a binder of, of music that we would always just play, right? Um, you know, we had Ina Kleino was one of them, so that's why I, I knew that song. Um, but you know, we would say things like, "Oh yeah, like are we gonna play the Chike again?" Or like, "What do you? Oh, let, let's play the Shosty Peach." Shosty being Shostakovich. Um, there was one Shostakovich that was really difficult. It's his string... I think it was a quartet. In F? Let's see. Shostakovich. It's the one that goes... That one is... It's really... It's really... Off-putting. It's the... That one. <laughs> Oh my gosh, am I in trombone land? No, I'm not. Not yet. Or not baboon land. String quartet in number eight. Yes, there we go. In C sharp minor. The rest of the song is also very off-putting, but like in a in a different kind of mood. But that specific movement is really intense. I really would love to play it again, but it's it's so difficult. I don't know if I'm there anymore in terms of skill of <gasps> Hello? Oh my gosh. Hello? No, not unlocked yet. <gasps> oh, the trombonists in... Oh, what do you call someone who plays the trombone? Trombonist? Is that what you call them? Are you... Are you I'm assuming this is um, something that all trombone players have seen. The brass medallion of the baboon. So, we're about to participate in trombone culture. Who is? Is everyone's minds open? Be open-minded and willing to learn. Here we go. Oh! We don't know the code. Oh my gosh, of course. Of course we don't know the code. We haven't been playing trombone long enough to know. Trombone players? What do we do? Uh, have I not been accepted into the... Into the society? Sir, please. Trombone horror game. Oh my gosh. Trombonist? I see. Am I not good enough yet? What do I have to do? Play the trombone along with a collection of amazing songs? Trombone gatekeeping? Oh no. I need four rank... Four S ranks? Oh my gosh, I, I don't know if I can do that. <laughs> I don't know if I can do that. Let, let's start Let's start with the easy songs, okay? Oh no, I don't... Let's, let's get an S on the warm-up, shall we? Come on, that's one. That's one. That counts. 
A student's trombone generally costs between 100 and... This is... Okay, so... Professional instruments are very expensive. Okay, here we go. Let me focus. Nice, nice, nice. Modulate, okay. Oh, a little sharp, that's fine. Da 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 Arpeggios, no problem. Ba, 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 ba. Scales, I can do them with my eyes closed. Yeah. Da, 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 ba, ba. Woohoo! Oh, my intonation was a little rocky there. That's okay. Uh, 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 uh. Arpeggios, more like arpeggios, cause I rocked. Yeah! Woo -hoo, woo -hoo. And that's why you do your warm ups, everybody. Oh, one step closer, one step closer to be inducted into the into the society of trombonists. Woo! -hoo. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Wow, I feel like a true trombone player now. Okay, here we go. All right. To this day, scientists really don't know how a trombone makes sound. Oh yeah, I wanted to tell you all my story, but I wonder if I can focus enough while I while I play. <gasps> oh wow. It's okay, that's a style point. That that was a stylistic choice. The little ornamentation there. Oh yeah, you, you gotta slide into it for a little bit of style. <laughs> da, da. Wait, where, where is it gonna be? <laughs> where is it gonna be? Here it is. Woo! Oh, a little pitchy, that's okay. Ooh. How, do you tune a trombone? Or do you just have to put it together? In, in the right way for it to be in pitch. Oh! <laughs> it caught me off guard again. Oh my gosh. Da 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 I feel like the scoring has got a lot kinder. Although I, I think I played this inverted last time. There's a slide at the back for tuning. I see! Okay, so the, the story I wanted to share with you all is expensive instruments. So, you all, for those who don't know, I have a viola. His name is Sebastian. I love my viola very much. Sebastian and I have been through very many interesting musical moments. Uh, so, Sebastian's actually a used instrument. Um, I didn't have very much money when I was younger. So, I always felt bad because not only was Sebastian a used instrument, I also never could, like, fix like my bow i always had a really like for lack of a better term crusty i had a really crusty bow um at least that's what that's what my director had called it once because the bottom had like little like brown old rosin on it so it was a little crusty and you know my my bow my my bridge is warped all that stuff my <laughs> my viola case has like a hole in it so humidifier like humidity control is not very great um so I, I got into the viola for probably, like, maximum $100. A maximum $100, $200. But I remember I was invited to help out at, like, a musical, like, show, a conference. I don't know what it was. And they had us, I, I was a volunteer, and they had us move instruments around. And they said, oh, Mita, you're, you know, you should be able to carry this cello. I was like, yeah, I've carried cellos before. And... So they handed it to me, I, 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 I started carrying it, and they said, Be careful, uh, uh, that's the price of a car. And I said, Like a used car? $3,000? And they said, No, 
Like a nice car, like $30,000. And I, I gasped. I immediately gasped. I thought, why did you hand it to me? <laughs> oh my gosh. And so I was very careful. Uh, but they, they were really nice. You know, they, they, they were like, you know, you've been helping around a lot. Why don't you play some of the instruments? And I got to play some of the old violins, violas. And oh, their sound is so rich. They're so nice absolutely wild but i'm not i'm also not surprised very not surprised yeah i was holding a whole car in my hands yup I, I i would pick something up i'd look at the price tag and i go hmm college tuition hmm down payment on a home hmm health insurance bill like it was so it was so crazy how expensive each one was um anyway <laughs> As a violist, how do you handle the viola jokes? I take them pretty well. I think, I think we're very used to them. That at this point, it's just part of the culture. I don't know. I feel like violists are very, very relaxed. We're, we're, we're very, we're the Hufflepuffs of the orchestra. If I had to sort all of the string instruments, well, there's only four houses, so I'll do the... All the strings except for bass. Because um, we didn't have very ba many basses at the time. So it was really hard to tell. Um, violins are Gryffindor. Or so one... I, I'll do... I'll separate first and second. Or I'll, I'll combine first and second so we can include the basses. So violin, Gryffindor. Okay. Cello, Slytherin, Viola, Hufflepuff, bass, Ravenclaw. That is my... That is my... Um, my sorting. That is my soul. <laughs> oh my gosh. And I, I say that from my personal experience. So maybe you have a different idea on, on what the different instruments would be sorted as. Okay, we need to get two more S ranks. We should do another one that I've played before. We should do Ina Kleina. Well, I don't know, this one had a lot of jumps. Let's see. Oh, ball game. I think I know this one. Professional trombone player. It's, see, look, it says trombone or not trombonist. Well, I guess you can use both words. Oh, gosh, I'm not ready. Take me out to the ball game. Take me out to the crowd. Ba -da 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 -da. That's the part I don't know. Oh, no. Da 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 That is one, two, three strikes, you're out! Oh, ball game! Oh, no! Oh, no! Take me out to the ball game. Take me out to the crowd. Da 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 Three strikes, you're out in the old ball game. Ba -ba. I don't know if I got an S rank on that one. Let's go Mets. No, oh, so close. What are the Mets? Are the Mets a, a, a baseball team? <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. I don't know O Canada or God Save the King. I don't. So maybe we should not do that because I don't know that one very well. Maybe I should do Ina Kleine because I know this song. Okay, here we go. They are indeed... Let's go Mets. Here we go. Can someone put the Mets copy pasta in my... Oh, here we go. In the chat. Maybe not. I mean, maybe not Ina Kleiner. Please do put the Mets copy pasta in my chat. Somebody give me viola champ and I have this song in the bag. I let go of the key.
Oh, wow, that was really bad. Nice jump. You know what they need to do? They need to make an orchestra anime. Hold on, hold on. I have, I have more to say to that. Because there are orchestra animes. Oh, wow. Well. Wow. Wow, Mozart. <laughs> I'm so intimidated by the Mozart that keeps popping in and out. Maybe we should be strategic about this. Maybe not Ina Kleina. Maybe I should play one of the other two songs, even though I don't know them very well. I think technically they won't be as hard to execute as Ina Kleina. Sick beats, Mozart. I agree. Yeah, I didn't make it. I made it to A, though. Oh, no. I, I only made it to B. Okay, let's do... Sure, let's do one of... Oh, gosh. But ball game wasn't too hard, either. Should I do it? I'll, I'll retry ball game. Or, no, you know what? We'll try. How much... How is the difference in difficulty? Okay, so, pause. I, I, I wanted to say this earlier, but I forgot to... We need to make an orchestra anime that is styled like a, a, a sports anime. Because I feel like all the classical music anime is either like romance or whatever. I think we should make one that's like a shonen sports anime. And I can help write for it. I'll, I'll, I'll kind of give you all examples. I'll pitch you all examples. This is easier to sight read, I will have to say. Like, I know Ina Kleina, but the execution of it is harder to do. But this is pretty easy to, like, sight read. Wow. Da, 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 da. Oh, yeah, see? Have you ever tried sight singing? It's really hard. Especially if you've never done any sort of, like, choir or, like, singing thing. I don't understand Soulfedge, if I'm being honest. Oh. Yeah. Woo! Yay! Reminds me of your niche desire that caters only to you. Oh my gosh, I feel that. That's why they should make a viola anime. They made a euphonium anime! They made an anime called Sound Euphonium. I think they should make... A anime called like play viola or something I don't know <laughs> but oh my gosh we got an S I think we need one more is that correct I don't know let's see I'm officially Canadian oh my gosh oh my gosh is that is that did we no we need one more we'll do God save the king one more okay okay before before we we do our last song to get an S hopefully you can get an S on this one I wanted to pitch my Shonen sports anime, but it's about orchestra. So, the reason why I say is I think there could be so many key moments for like suspense and action. So, just now when I was playing one of the songs, there was a huge jump. I think we should do, I think we could like include moments like that, like really slow down the piece and go, oh my gosh, there's an octave jump coming up. I don't know if I can make it. I haven't practiced this. And then, you know, they'll, they'll pull out some really cool, like, you know, you know, so I don't know what trombone, like I don't know what sort of techniques trombonists use to, to to play notes or whatever. Or like maybe maybe you know you're doing a sight reading and it's like oh my gosh I don't know if I should play this in second position or third position. I don't know. Well, let's see. And like we can they can have like I don't know. <laughs> maybe as a violist I'm thinking about this too much. But I think there's a lot of really. And then oh my gosh, that's only just during the pieces themselves. Like, there's already so much intensity that could happen as they play music. Imagine, imagine the drama, the intensity outside of the music. Here, let me show you. you they're, they're, they're putting together, you know, the orchestra for their first concert. Seating test. Who gets first, second, third? The drama! The drop. Who is concert master? Who, who's going to be principal for this section? Oh my gosh, I can see it already. 
you know, they're, they're all they're all sitting and waiting for the conductor to give out the seating, the seating chart or whatever. And they say, so and so, second chair. And they go, oh, how will I face my family now? How am I supposed to make it to nationals? You know what I mean? Tournament arc? Yes! Oh my gosh! So they're they're like competing. Okay, here we go. They're competing for like, I don't know, like a, like a prefectural like orchestra. And then everyone's there like competing for a spot in the orchestra. I'm glad. I'm glad you all want to see this anime come to life. Thank you, Ariel, for the super chat. Noir, thank you for the super chat as well. I don't know. Solfege is so confusing. I learned it once in a, in a class. And because part of the exam was you had to sightsee. Thankfully, it was only a small part of the exam. And... You know, I, I didn't have to worry about it too much. And he had to sight read two pieces. They were two about 30 second long pieces. One was in 3 4 or 6 8. And the other one was in 4 4 or 2 4. And then I can't remember how else they differed. One was in a major key, one was in a minor key. What else? And I think that was pretty much it in and, and the, and the way that the two differed. And you just had to, you, you didn't have to sing in solfege. You can use whatever words you wanted. But as long as the notes were correct, that's what you were graded on. I heard that somebody who also took the test, instead of doing solfege or going like la 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 la, they did a pro gamer move. And using the correct notes that they had on the sheet music, they sung the lyrics to All Star. Isn't that crazy? <laughs> oh my gosh. I, I So I get the idea of solfege. Like, you know, major starts with do, minor starts with la. Sure, but the the, the execution of it is, I think, is a, di a very different story. <laughs> oh my gosh. It was very brilliant. You know how difficult it must have been to separate the original tune, right? Because they can't go, somebody once told me. Imagine singing All-Star, but the notes are all different. That's basically that. They were, they really were the sharpest tool in the shed. I have seen the Bach Chorale arrangement of All-Star. It's so good. Have you all seen the the medieval arrangements of like different songs? They're so fun because the comment section gets really fun. Go search up like Britney Spears medieval arrangement, Blackpink medieval arrangement. They're so good. Okay, we need to do one more. We need to get one more S rank. And then we can go meet the baboon. <gasps> uh, I love ska. I, I listen to a lot of ska music because of Tony Hawk's Pro Skater. Oh. oh no, I don't know the song. Da, da, da. Oh, no, I do know this song. Da, da, da. Da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. Although the lyrics are a little different from what I remember. I love the the pictures in the background. Da 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 Baboon time. Who's ready? Who's ready for the baboons? Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Off the screen, nice. No. Oh. Here we go. Dun dum bum. Oh. Choose your trombone. How fast can you click? Not very fast. <laughs> if I'm being honest. Okay, here we go. Baboon. Oh. <gasps> okay. Remember, everyone, this is an important part of trombone culture. So, we're gonna go into this with an open mind. And an open heart. 
Nope, that's not it. Oh, because... Oh! That's why they had a letter S. The Order of the Baboon. I don't know if I'm worthy. Ah! I'm so scared! Sir? <gasps> Hello? What have we done? What did we do? Did we upset the order of the baboon? Is there something different here? What happened? Keep clicking it? Okay. Sir? I understand. <sighs> I understand now. <laughs> Here's how I'm trying to ration rationalize it in my brain. Is it was that for like the lung capacity thing? Is it because you need a strong lung capacity to to play the trombone? Was this like a check a checkpoint? <laughs> Died to over read I well, I think my my lung capacity has certainly been tested for sure. I don't speak baboon. Are thou the one who hath been a knocking on my little hatch? <gasps> I'm not gonna lie. Yes. Was that how was my baboon? Thou art truthful. That is good. Th is a knocking not what hatches are for, after all? You know, <laughs> you know what this reminds me of? <laughs> Who has seen Voltron? Like on Netflix. The new, the newer Voltron. With like Shiro and Keith and Pidge. I don't know if that's what they were called in the original Voltron. But do you remember? <laughs> do you remember Bebo B? You remember Bebobi? Bebobi was well. There was a whole alien species that talked like this. Bebop, Bebop, Bebop. But Bebobi was a special. Bebobi was like their recurring friend. But they would talk like this. They would go Bebop, Bebop, Zoltron, Bebop, 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 Zarkon. It was really funny. <laughs> That's what this reminds me of. I seeketh the trombone champ. Is thine wish to become the champ? Yes. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> that is good news. Alloweth me to introduce myself. I am the primordial baboon, Toot Seeker Tom. Allow me to show you something. <gasps> Feast thine eyes upon the Toot Vessel. Click and hold on the, on the Toot Vessel to awaken. How does this affect my life personally? I don't know. <gasps> These are questions for which I've long since forgotten the answers. My bad. Oh, that's okay. <gasps> The tooth vessel. I keep saying tooth. The tooth vessel requires toots. Feed it toots and the cleft shall awaken. It's a vessel for toots. Okay, I understand the etymology. Let's go. All right, let's do it. The treble clef. I what? What happened? We have not seen once an alto clef. What is this alto clef erasure? <gasps> Woo! Oh, we have more than enough toots. Good thing we didn't spend it. too much. Oh my gosh. <gasps> we woke it up. Good morning. Oh, good morning. A gotcha box. Oh, yeah. Click that chest. It feels like we're punching it more than anything. Oh, I can't click very fast. Uh... You play the video game a lot and unlock the thing! Woohoohoo! Oh. oh, this is what money is for. I see. This is like the Great Fairy Fountain. 
Here you go. Here's my money. We should have saved on the gotcha. We should. Oh gosh. <gasps> oh yeah. The Toot Vessel awakens. Oh, here we go. Are you, are you ready to click? <gasps> oh! They should hire me to do the voice acting in Dragon Ball Z. Muted! Like with a mute? I don't know what a trombone... Well, no, that's a lie. I know what a trumpet mute looks like. Do they look the same? <gasps> I don't have enough toots. Oh, no. I don't have enough toots. Should I make more toots to get another box? What do you all think? Let's go back. Let's earn more toots. See, that's what happens when you when you focus too much on gotcha. We, we in but we only got one box of gotcha. One bag of gotcha. <gasps> Muted? Let's try it. Is it just quieter or... Trombone skies? Drop some money! All oh, this bread's so yummy! That's right. Drop some money to... Oh. I wonder if you can make custom beat maps. Oh, it is muted. Okay. Wow. I like the song. It's gonna be 2050 and you're gonna go to a classics concert and this is the song. Wow. Ba 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 I should cover this song. Oh no! I should learn this on viola? Oh yeah! Woohoo! Ending, ending champ moment there. Woohoo! No, I was so close, but I got 400 toots. That's all that matters. How much do we need? How many toots do we have? We need 2,500, right? Gosh. No mute present in the bell of the trombone. Zero ten game. You should demand a refund. <laughs> oh, is it gonna jump scare me again? Ah! That wasn't as bad. I was expecting it that time, so it's okay. We need 500 more. Let's just fill it up real quickly and then come back so we're not tempted to spend it on gotcha or anything. Oh, see, it's okay. That, that time I was expecting it. It's okay. I like the regular trombone. The, I think the mute was really nice for that specific song, but... What is this one? Hob... Wait, I, I wasn't paying attention to the description. Welcome in! We have a couple of folks who just popped in. Welcome, welcome. Oh! Ba 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 
I don't know if we're gonna get very many toots on this one. So there's the Star of David in the back. Is this like important to... Hold on. Oh gosh, I, I really have to focus. Oh gosh! What is this song from? Oh gosh! I've never heard this song before. Ah, octave jumps! They're so hard! Whoa, lightning! <laughs> Singing along helps me guess what's gonna happen. Let's see. Oh, it's play. It's typically played during a wedding reception or bar or bat mitzvahs. Okay, cool. Oh, also, so it is a Jewish staple. I see. I see. Nice. Written by the seventh. Maybe I should go. Because I'm just trying to get toots, right? I, I'm not trying to do particularly well. The trombone is not related to the French horn. They're just friends. <gasps> just be friends. All we gotta do. Oh, do. I don't know this song either. Oh, I don't think the 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 key that I was pressing was registering. <laughs> oh my gosh! I I chose a different key this time. It's okay. There we go. Oh. Oh oh. There we go. There we go. I, I want to say this is very interesting song. Oh, I do know the song. Da 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 I don't I, I don't know the rest of this part. What is this song from? Dun, 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 dun. What is that song? I don't know. I don't know where I know this from. Hey, our usual. I think we have enough now. So let's 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 go back. Bum, 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 bum. Baboon, please don't hurt me. Why do you like to hurt me? It's okay, I closed my eyes that time. Yay, we have enough! Okay. <gasps> oh yeah, who's ready? Get your lungs ready! Oh. I like that. I'm going super safe. All of the rings are lit. Oh my gosh. The one ring to rule them all. 
Give me. <laughs> Wait a minute. That's not it? Wait, do we not get the trombone of legend? Whoop! Well, at least we tried. <laughs> oh, the clef is the final piece. Oh, why is the world driven by money? Gosh. Can't we just play music and enjoy it? Oh my gosh. Okay, well, back to the grind, I guess. Long tail limbo. Who is this? Oh my gosh. 2,500! Do you think we can do it? We gotta earn our keep. Good thing we got the 8-bit sound. I don't know, I kinda don't like it. I miss playing trombone. I do like the song though. That was crazy. This sounds like an automaton. Wow, this is insane. Oh no, I didn't slide fast enough. And yes, hello, Vaughn Gang. Bum. Bum. What do you think? How did I do? Hey, not bad. Oh my gosh, how many, how many toots are we at right now? Can someone keep track? How many toots are we? We should just play the ones that we haven't played yet. I think. Trombones don't float in water. Mm, you probably shouldn't put a trombone in water like that. Da, 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 da. I'm gonna change back to trombone. I miss it. The trombone sound. Oh no! I like this song! Yay! Oh, it's a polka song. That's nice. Beer barrel polka. Wow! Okay, how many more toots? Do do do. Skip to my loo. Oh, I guess since we're going back, since I switched. Oh, whoa. Polygon. Let's do that. Let's try it. I'm gonna miss soda, but that's okay. Out credits? No. Let's. I think we can see how many we have here. Oh, don't get tempted by the gotcha. A thousand. We need fifteen hundred more. Nine hundred ninety-seven. Can someone keep track? I'm not very good with math. Mental math, that is. No, I kind of miss soda. I'm gonna keep soda. I know, I wish they showed us our total tooth, but I guess they want us to focus on the music. Ska! 
Ah, here we go. Cows love the sound of trombone because they're smart. Oh. Yeah, 15, about 1,500 more. Let's keep track. Oh gosh. This is so hard. Nice. Woohoo. Imagine if this is what sheet music looked like for trombone players. Oh my gosh, this is such a fun song though. It sounds like a song though, right? Like I'm not... I don't sound bad. Well, there, there I did. <laughs> Yoo-hoo! Woo-hoo-hoo! It does sound like Skull. Good for most of that slide section. My, my, oh. I can't guess the melody here. My mouse got caught on a wire just now. In that section, <laughs> that's okay. As a musician, you have to learn to keep going no matter what happens. Stylistic choices, stylistic choices. <laughs> Ooh, and welcome in, welcome in. We have some new folks coming in. Welcome, welcome. We're just going to keep going through all the songs we haven't played yet. Oh my gosh, Beethoven's Fifth, a classic. Okay, hand stretch. Ooh, okay, here we go. Playing trombone in your apartment is a great way to make friends with your neighbors. Aw, that's nice. Oh gosh, here we go. This is from the trailer, too. Oopsie daisy. Da 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 I'm guessing, I, look at all the X's. Oops. Da, da, da. Maybe I should adjust my licensee, it's okay. You know what I just realized? I did my latency test with my mouse and not the keyboard. <laughs> I don't know if that would make a difference. So I, for the latency test, I did it with the mouse, but I've been using my keyboard this whole time. <laughs> I 
that's okay. I'm not gonna go back and change it. Da, 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 da. Beethoven would be proud. Thank you, thank you. Oh my gosh. Ugh. I think it's because my, um... My... Oh. Da 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 oh no da 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 close to an S. That's okay. But we got our 589 tooth. How many more now? I haven't been keeping track, so I hope you all have. <laughs> oh my gosh. Gladiators. Okay, sure. There are between two and four spiders living inside the average trombone. That probably makes sense. The humidity probably fosters a good environment for spiders. That was an insane run. Da 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 you know what I think they should do for this game? They should have, like, a symphony mode where, like, you play, like, entire, like, suites of symphony. Like, you play an entire 45-minute, like, I don't know, like, symphony. Like, you play an entire symphony for 45 minutes straight. And you have, like, like an endurance test. How crazy would that be? Like, play an entire piece. Play an entire concert. You, you have to sit there and play an entire concert. Multiplayer sounds so cool! How many toots are we at now? Are we good on toots? Are we tooting along? <laughs> oh my gosh. Let's see. Let's see. Back. Back. Collect. Yay! We have enough! 
Let's go get it. Remember, be mindful of this gear. Oh, jeez. That was a lot sooner than I expected. I said cheese instead of jeez. How funny is that? Oh. Wee bop. Beep bop boop. Okay, everybody, get your lungs ready. <gasps> the mysterious blue key. Oh no, it's silent. <gasps> There's more to do. More money. More money. <gasps> Where's what was the key for? Is it here? Is it that? Okay, don't look. Oh, he came from a different angle this time. <gasps> Where? What? What to do? In here. Oh no! Ah! I just want to know where the... I just want to know where... Where's the key go? Baboon jump scare indeed. Hello. That was fast that time. Oh my gosh. Do we have to do gotcha? I know. I'm going to look for the lock somewhere. Maybe it's in one of the games. Let's see. Hmm. Settings? Funny jump scare! Oh my gosh! I didn't even notice that! Where? Does anyone know where it is? Advanced info. <gasps> it's okay, I don't really. Baboon facts! She would really like these facts. Let's see. It's in the gotcha game? Turd card? I do not own this card. I, you can turd a card. How do you get a turd? No. Oh, if you have different if you have multiple copies of a of a card, you can turd a card. I see. I know how this works now. Huh! Clicking the candle in the collection... What do you all think? Where do you all think the key is? Or the lock? Hello? I can't afford any sax. Oh, gosh. Get it, saxophone? Ha <laughs> Uh... Huh! Maybe in the credits? Play tester. Interesting. Oh, I have to get more cards? Alright, we gotta play some more. With Soda, our trusty trombonist. Let's see. Stars and Stripes! Oh yeah! Here we go. I think I know this song. This is a grind game, huh? Oh my gosh. Oh wow, this is hard. Ba, 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 ba. I thought I knew this song, but I don't. Bum. 
Wow. Ow, bite. Oh, gosh. I'm gonna use a different finger on my hand. Oh, gosh. Wow. Focus mode. Oh, I know this part. Da 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 Wow! <laughs> wow! Wow! But uh, oh, fireworks! Ba 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 ba. Oh no! Yay! No, oh, they, they they clapped along with me. Okay, let's go. Let's go get a, a gotcha set. Let's go to a pool. Oh yeah, give me a sec. Yes. Woohoo! <gasps> Melba Liston, Bill Watrous. A trumpet. The coward's trombone. WC. Oh my gosh, look. H O T. Hot dogs. Hot dog. Do you see that? Hot dogs. Why does it say hot dogs? Do we need to turn this one? It says hot dogs. Look. H O T D O G S. I think we need to turn this card. No, no, no. I mean, build this card. Oh my gosh. We need to find a... We need to have a card that we can turn. Read the other card descriptions. I'm scared. Popular jazz trombonist of the modern era who studied with jazz pianist Irby Nichols while serving in the U.S. Navy and was well known among trombonists for his technical skill and pleasant sound. See, that's nice! Is there... Oh, so that was the WC. Is you say WC or WC? I like WC and Chopin. I, well, I guess they're they're very similar in in sound. Glissando. Disgusting. Look at that, what it says. The coward's trombone. Is there a backside to these cards? A forty-five. Forty. <gasps> Whether or not he ate hot dogs is unknown. Is this part of trombone culture? Hmm. Hmm. Let's play again. Let's do one more. Let's, we, we, we gotta get one more sack. What's one we haven't played yet? Have we played them all already? I guess we have. Aw, man. Let's see. Maybe I'll do... I like skip to my, my Lou. That was fun. Let's do one more sack. And then we'll, we'll, we'll see what happens. <gasps> wow. Dance along with soda. Woohoo! <laughs> 
ba 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 Okay, 332 tubes. Okay, let's go. That should give us enough for another sack, right? Or am I misremembering how many? Let's do one more. Just... And thanks for stopping by for heading out for the day. Let's do... Uh, sugar Plum Fairy again. Ah, okay, hand stretches. Okay, here we go. Let's see. Don't want to get carpal tunnel. Oh, gosh. Woohoo! Bum. Ba 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 I love playing the Nutcracker Suite. Um, around the winter time. It's so fun. Da, 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 da. I like what is it called? Travac? Is that one of the songs? I forgot what it's called. Da 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 ba 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 Wow yeah. Right because I watched someone else play this and I legitimately didn't realize what song it was when they did this one. At least I could recognize it when I do it. Thank you! I'm happy to hear that. I, I know a lot of uh, Tchaikovsky's music, so I guess that helps. Yay! Woohoo! When you were little, you called the Nutcracker the Nutkicker? No! That's so silly. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Give me a sack! I can afford two! Hmm. I love Bartok's. I've played a couple of Bartok pieces. Ooh, another trombone player. Look, an uh, American session tromboner recorded for a number of legendary musicians. Hmm, never heard. <gasps> oh my gosh. Oh, is this the is this the legendary hot dog we've been looking for? <gasps> and Mozart. We, we all know Mozart. Is this important? Let's do another sack. Woohoo! Hmm. <gasps> Eaten nine hot dogs in one sitting. Oh gosh! Red eyes, black baboon. Oh my gosh. Stravinsky. Okay. <gasps> I love Mazorksky. Pictures at an exhibition. I really like pictures at an exhibition. Um. The Great Gate, a wonderful piece from Pictures. Um, Baba Yaga is also a good one from Pictures. There's a lot of good ones from Pictures. What happens now? Do I not have enough cards? Hmm. I want to get another sack. I feel like I haven't collected enough. <gasps> what is this? candle you guys were talking about? Greetings, noble tromboner. Thank you for summoning me. My name, 
well, maybe some things are best kept secret for now. I'll assume you summoned me on purpose and weren't just mindlessly clicking the chaos candle. Well, what did say you, noble tromboner? Greeting! Only an inquisitive soul would find me here. Do you seek to become the trombone champ? Yes. But do you even really know what the trombone champ is? Nope. You will in time. Yes, the baboons will show you the way. I can help you become the trombone champ, but I need magic to do so. And my magic requires sacrificing tromboner cards. Why does my magic require you to sacrifice tromboner cards, you ask? It's best not to ask questions like this. Just go with the flow. So, will you agree to help me? Sure. Excellent. <laughs> yes! Yes! Oh gosh, dot, dot, dot. <gasps> I currently require one Max Tundra, one Brass. Oh my gosh, isn't this the composer of the game? And one Beethoven. Can you give me these cards? Not right now. I can give... No, I can't. Okay, I'm sorry. I don't have the cards you see. What do we do? Should we keep going or call it a day? What? How much left of the game is there? I don't know if I can do any better on these songs. Hey, S-Ring. This is kind of fun. <laughs> but I don't know if I can get any better on these songs. Let's do Blue Danube. Okay. These are really fun. Okay. Because if, if there's more, if there's quite a bit left, then we'll probably just save it for another... For another stream. I've reached my limit on the musical ability. I can't get any better than this. But I think we can still get toots. Right? Da da ba. Da 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 I wait, I can just hold on to it. Da 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 That's probably not very musical of me. Oh, oh, you run out of breath and you can't play anymore. I see. That was about to say that. It seems a little too easy. We have new trombone strats. We had to learn phrasing. Oh, I see. Oh. I see. Interesting. I wanted to test the boundaries of, of you know, how how long he could play. So I, I see the, 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 the pitch kind of changes too if you hold on for too long. Yes, I do want to purchase a sack of cards. Please, please. Tea garden. Another hot dog. Rachmaninoff. Okay, that's new. And Gluck. Okay, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta turn one of these cards. Just one. Goodbye! Can we, we have 172 turns. We, uh, we don't have enough to build a card, though. That's okay. Uh, I think that's good for today. What do you all think? Did you all, in, did you all have fun? <laughs> Ooh, that 
yeah, maybe, who knows? Maybe I'll do an, uh, another surprise stream to, to finish up the, the candle. But I'm feeling good for the day. I think I'm all tromboned out. <laughs> but if you had lots of fun, you can stick around for a few more minutes. We're going to do some chatting and super chat reading before we head out for the day. <laughs> it was lots of fun. I'm happy to hear that. If you if you missed the stream, you can be sure you can be sure to join VOD Gang. VOD Gang, hello. Nothing wrong with being VOD Gang. Or nothing wrong with lurking. Nothing wrong with doing whatever you 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 need. I hope you all had fun today and let's get some super chat reading done, shall we? Let's go. Da 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 Dum bum 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 bum. I'm assuming it's auto save. Could you imagine if it didn't save? Oh my god. This is definitely one of the oddest games you've seen. I love it. I love funny games like this. And thank you, Shiny. Yes, our last stream of the week is going to be Archangel Radio with Nami. I remember she was helping me with um some bread signs. <laughs> oh my gosh. And hello, welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. Is that Kitty? Welcome to the stream. I think we also had a couple of folks pop in. Hello, Callie. Welcome in. I know. I think you just popped in when we when we just got started. Hello. <laughs> oh my gosh. Let's see. Let's read our super chats for the day, shall we? Chunky, thank you again for celebrating your eighth month as Idol Coach. Gonna lurk today as I'm preparing something special for your birthday. Thank you. And yes, no, don't worry. I won't pick. I won't peek. I won't take a look. Uh, but yes, my birthday is next week. Uh, my actual birthday, since it's during the week, I'm just going to be playing some Genshin. But my actual celebration is going to be on the weekend, Friday evening Pacific. So Saturday morning, JST. Um, yeah, it's going to be fun. And what's really great is the, the what is it called? The Mondstadt something or other. Mondstadt wine. It's like the wine festival or something. The wine, wineless, wineless fest. It's a wine festival. It says the wine fest. Well, I don't know how to pronounce it. Is a festival in Mondstadt revolving around making new wine and inviting the animal Archon to drink if the animal Archon is happy with the wine. Isn't that funny? So that's I'll be playing that event next week for for stream. So should we get like a celebratory bottle of wine, not just for the wine festival, but also for my birthday, perhaps? What do you think? What do you think? <laughs> oh gosh, I'm not really a like a, a, a wine connoisseur. Uh, if anything, I've enjoyed uh, honey wine. Have you ever like? I don't. I don't really like you know the metallic taste of alcohol. For me, it's more. Uh, I I really only drink alcohol in like a in in a mm, food sort of sense. Like I, I like a, a I usually go with like a recommendation if if it goes well with like a meal, or like if it's a birthday celebration, yeah I, I like to celebrate. I usually I usually only drink alcohol if it's like a celebration, or like if there's like a special food that I'm eating. Yeah I don't know. Let's see. Have you ever had mead before, honey wine? That's what it's called, right? Mead. Maybe that'll be w w that will be my 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 wine of choice for the Mondstadt Wine Festival. It says mead is an alcoholic beverage made by fermenting honey mixed with water. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I I prefer fruitier drinks as well. I, I I really can't deal with the metallic taste. I like cider. Cider is nice. Mm hmm. But I, I thought that'd be a very fun, you know, since it's my birthday and it's also the Mondstadt Wine Festival. I think that'd be a good combination, right? <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, yes. Yes. Hard cider. But apparently in Japan, if you say cider, they automatically mean hard cider. Isn't that interesting? What if we name a drink after you? Oh my gosh. What would it be like? I don't really, I don't really like. I'm not really uh, knowledgeable when it comes to alcoholic drinks, but sure, by all means, I'd be more than happy. 
Oh my gosh. Fizzle, thank you for so much for celebrating your ninth month as idol coach. You're an idol coach too. Yeah. That's, yes, indeed. That is your title. Oh my gosh. Let's see. <laughs> my, my, uh, my, what's it called? My, my super chat video disappeared on me, so I'm looking for it. Oh, there it is. Okay. <laughs> I accidentally, here's what happened. I, you know how at the bottom of the monitor, there's like a button that, that closes all of your windows? Not closes, but minimizes all your windows. I accidentally clicked it. <laughs> And so I was furiously clicking open all of my windows again <laughs> to return them back to my screen. Oh my gosh. Hello, Spartan. Welcome to the stream. Cobalt Angel could be a mixed drink. Ah, that sounds really nice. I like the name. I will have to say that button is really nice and convenient, but sometimes I, I click it on accident when I don't mean to. It's so silly. <laughs> oh my gosh. Let's see. Um, hmm. There we go. Absolute Link, thank you so much for the dodo, the Canadian, the maple leaf. Oh my gosh. Was that when I did the uh, Canadian song? Is that the anthem? Let's see. Noah, thank you so much for the super chat. Trying a summary of Soul Fetch, how I learned it. Every note has its corresponding figure. Do, re, mi, fa, sol, la, ti, do. Do always functions as the base and major laws to start minor keys. Yes. So, <laughs> wow. What a throwback to music theory. I remember they taught us how to use the hand signs too. This isn't like Naruto Jutsu hand signs. This is this is something completely different. It's like one if you use one hand for soul fetch. And I could never I could never get it. And you know, they they, they taught it to us in one day and I thought, oh my gosh, I, I can't learn this in one day. And the very next day they, they they taught us like the hand signs for like meh. And like the like lowering some of the nose. I thought, oh my gosh, I haven't even gotten the regular soul fetch down yet. What are you gosh? They also taught us about nooms. Do you all know what nooms are? Nooms. Let's see. How do I how do you spell N-E-U-M-E-S, probably? Yeah, nooms. Uh a noom is a basic element of Western and Eastern sim systems of musical notation prior to the invention of the five line staff notation. N-E-U-M-E-S. I, I just double-checked myself. It's like this. You've probably seen it in, like, uh, like, really old religious music. Oh, I was gonna start singing. <laughs> Why was I about to start singing the Halo? Oh, that is not religious music. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, Gregorian. There we go. Gregorian chant. It's used a lot in Gregorian chant. Yeah. <laughs> Halo. It's, yeah, it is a Gregorian chant, but I don't think it's religious, is it? Halo music feels religious. Exactly. Oh. Should I do a learning, learning how to read Nooms stream? Rita learns Gregorian chant. What if I did a Gregorian chant stream? Would you all be... Would you all be interested? Be honest. Let's see. Gregorian... Hold on. Gregorian music. Really? <laughs> be honest. What, 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 what do you think would be interesting? Oh my gosh. Gregorian Viva La Vida. I'm going to listen to this, but you all can't hear it, but I can't. Whoa! <laughs> it really is! It's Viva La Vida, but in Gregorian chant. <laughs> this is great! This is fantastic. This is amazing. Oh. Well, I'm enamored. I'm like, enraptured. Wow. Oh, and they even have, what is that, the, the, that one instrument that Isabella plays in Promise Neverland. Wow, this is really good. This reminds me of the, the medieval, like, remixes, medieval, search up, like, medieval Blackpink. I remember, I remember, because one of the comments, because you know how Black, Blackpink, their, 
tagline is black pink in your area somebody in the comments said black plague in thy area and i oh my gosh yeah black pink how you like that medieval cover slash bardcore bardcore do you all like bardcore i'm gonna click it it's really good it's really good music What's what there was another really good it was a it, I'm pretty sure it was a Britney Spears song. Medieval I medieval is always is a hard is a hard to spell word. Medieval what is it? Britney Spears? I think so. Bardcore is great. I don't think it was toxic though. You're toxic. I'm something under I don't think it was I, I don't know. You'll have to search up medieval remixes of songs. They're great. Or covers, not remixes. Let's see. Ariel, thank you for the super chat. Starting an anime fund. This needs to exist. Viola anime win. That's all I have to say. If they need... If they... Oh my gosh. What if one day they make a Viola anime and I get to voice act for it? I'd be good for it. I know what it's like to be a violist. I felt... I felt things as a violist. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I don't know. I feel like being a violist isn't as intense as being a violinist. I think it'd be a nice, like, slice of life. Being a violist. Because I feel like being a violist, you kind of just are part of all of the, the chaos. Because I feel like violists are very much like the middle ground. Quite literally, we do sit in the middle. Where the middle ground... You know what? That's such a nice way of putting it. You know, because not only are we quite literally physically in the middle of an orchestra... But we're also kind of just in the middle of it all. In, in, in that, like, violinists are, are always very, like, Gryffindor. You know? Like, they're very competitive. They're very... They're constantly on the go. They're constantly on the move. And then you have the more, like, contemplative, like, thoughtful cellists and bassists. But then you have us. Right? You just have the good old violists. It's not much, but it's honest work. You know what I mean? <laughs> Let's see. Professor Jamal, thank you so much for the dono. Turn orchestra into a full body contact sport with anime. You know what I've you know what I've thought of? I've definitely thought about this before. You know how they have marching band? Imagine marching orchestra. Just a concept I'm gonna throw out there. Just something to think about. Uh, you know? <laughs> Let's see. Full body contact sport with crazy power ups and a wise old maestro who everyone thought died or retired, but simply stepped out of the limelight to find a suitable pupil after he lost his family pursuing his passion. Wow. You know what this reminds me of? Classical Lloyd. Do you all know Classical Lloyd? My favorite. I don't know if I have a favorite character in Classical Lloyd, but I know Yuki Kaji voices Mozart. That's all I remember. Um, let's see. They had Beethoven, Mozart, um, Chopin, Liszt, Schubert, Bach. They didn't have all of the, the big Bs. They had Beethoven and Bach. Who are the other big Bs? It's like the big four, right? Here, the four Bs in classical music. Beethoven, Bach, Brahms! And Bruckner? Who is that? I just think of Bach, Beethoven, and Brahms. Oh, it's the three Bs. Okay, okay. Someone was suggesting that that would be a good fourth B. I don't know. I feel like I don't listen to a lot of music by Brahms. I, I just I just remember Bach and Beethoven. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I love Chopin. So my favorite composers are Chopin and Debussy. I think it's because they're... Their music is very similar. I think actually WC was either inspired or studied under Chopin. So that's I, I guess that's why I really enjoy. But I also like Shostakovich. Um I don't know. I, I like the I like a lot of I like the Shost, you know, the Shostakovich motif. It's very different. Um what other composers do I really like? I like Schubert. Schubert. <laughs> Um, I don't know. I'm not a huge fan of Vivaldi or Mozart. That's just a personal preference. Um, I don't know. I, I, I guess I, I just don't like... Gosh. Um, I don't really like Baroque composers. So I guess that's why I'm not really a big fan of Vivaldi. Sorry. 
Are these Rita hot takes? I don't know if they're hot takes. I just, I just have a personal preference. I don't like Baroque music. Um, so I, I, I like more impressionistic music. Um, let's see. I do like contemporary music, like contemporary classical music. Um, I'm trying to think of what else. Oh, I'm sorry. Do we have Vivaldi fans out there? I'm sorry. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I, I'm just not a huge fan of Baroque music. So, gosh. Yeah, so I'm not really a huge fan of Bach. Sorry to say. Okay. I do like Telemann. And maybe it's because I've played a lot of, like, viola pieces. Um, Maybe that's why I don't mind Telemann. Um, I don't like Handel. Handel did what? Messiah or something like that? I don't know. I... What is his name? Purcell? I'm also not really a huge fan either. Um... Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I know! Is that a hot take? I'm sorry! Uh, Vivaldi's really, you know, well-known. I don't dislike all of his music. I do like listening to the Four Seasons, but I just prefer other... other, like, artists. Right. <laughs> Oh my gosh. But like like I said, I really like uh, Impressionist music. So I, I mentioned WC. I really like... Um, I don't know if I know any other. I just like listening to... Oh, Sibelius? Um, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's more of a personal thing. Yeah, you don't have to... Everyone has... Hold on, I have to fix my headphones. They, they, they are all bent now. What did I do? Oh. Hold on, I have to take my head... I guess I don't need to wear my headphones. I'm not wearing... I'm not playing... I'm not playing trombone champ anymore. <laughs> oh my gosh, let's see. Let's see. Um... I don't know. I, I feel like I don't know too much about... Um... Classical music. But in, in terms of contemporary composers... I mentioned I like contemporary music too. Um... Ravel? I, I like Ravel. I I played a, a Ravel quartet before. That was really fun. Um, how does it go? So that that was a that was a nice piece. Um, hmm, what other? I don't know. I, there's just all different kinds of music that I like. <laughs> um, let's see. I mean, let me search up some contemporary composers actually. Okay, let's see. Hmm. Yeah, I don't really know. I mean, John Williams? Like, th I guess that counts as contemporary, right? Let's see. <laughs> well, I guess I, I, I guess I'm more familiar with contemporary music because it's, you know, of course, contemporary. So, <laughs> oh my gosh, let's see. Let me look at the the timeline of history. Oh my gosh! <gasps> uh, Samuel Barber? Is anyone like postmodern? Oh my gosh, Elliot Carter. Oh my gosh, Samuel Barber, the Barber Adagio. Oh my god. Let's see, I'm looking at the... I'm the different composers. Oh, Ligeti! Ligeti is a postmodern composer. Let's see. Ooh, Renaissance composers. Let's see. Let me, let me, let me, let me give my list of favorite Renaissance composers. I'm looking at the list. Um, of time periods. Oh, um, I'm looking, I'm looking. I don't know. Uh, mm, I don't really know a lot. William Byrd. <laughs> uh, let's see. Let's go to the next time period. Baroque, mm, not a fan. Classical, here we go. Oh, here we go. Yup. Oh, yeah. Let's see. Schumann. I like Schumann. Let's see. Oh, Vivaldi. Okay. Mm -hmm. Telemann. I would think of Vivaldi as more Baroque than classic. Oh, pa Packle Bell? Canon and D. Anyone? Bach? Let's see. History of classical music. Yes, there's different time periods that are... That are influenced by different things. I do like Baroque artwork. I think Baroque artwork is always really dramatic and, and 
interesting to look at. Um, let's see. I do like the romantic era, so let me let me go there. I like the romantic era. That's where you know. It's 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 I don't know. <laughs> I, I I just like the um the vibe, I guess. Beethoven. Let's see. What else? Who else is in this one? Probably Schubert. I like Schubert. Let's see. Who else is in this? I don't really know much. Oh. Interesting. Sorry, I love music history. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, Kreutzer. That's a that's a name I recognize. Uh wasn't Kreutzer in Your Light April? Um, let's see. Paganini. Let's see. Anyone know Paganini? I know Paganini. Um, let's see. Ba -ba 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 -ba. I'm looking, I'm looking. Mozart, okay. Let's see. There's so many composers I'm not familiar with. I should probably look more. Schubert, okay. Early romantic. Interesting. I love... I love... I love classical music. <laughs> Alright, enough, enough of that. Enough of the history. Music history. Let's see. Mr. Beardy Face, thank you for the dodo. That was decidedly fun and silly. I really like the part where it went... Wop, wop, wop. Wop, 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 wop. Wop, 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 well, oh, Chopin was also in this time period, early romantic. And Schumann, Liszt. Oh, yes. Okay, this is very much in the time period where I really like. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah. Okay, I got distracted again. Um, saying thank you for the dodo. Thank you for the stream from Vod Gang. I quite not catch up to all the streams yet, but listening to your voice gives me happy. I'm happy to hear that. And Iman, thank you for the dono. Thanks for all the musical exploration today. Here's to all of us getting our niche anime produced. Be they orchestra, acapella, or otherwise. A an acapella anime would be super cool. Yeah. Gosh, there's a there's a group that I used to watch a lot. Um, from a college or something. I think it was BYU. And they did like a Newsies. Thing. I think I think it was Newsies. <gasps> yeah, so BYU Vocal Point did a one-shot a cappella of uh, Newsies, I think. And they have a wonderful behind the scenes. In fact, I think I'm gonna watch it after this. Um, yeah, but they're, they're, they're really, their work is really cool. Yeah. Yeah, BYU Vocal Point. Get it? Because it's like Vocal Point. <laughs> oh my gosh. Straight No Chasers is a, is a very good a cappella group. I'll have to look them up. I'm not familiar. But a huge shout out to today's Bread Heist trombonists. Ariel, Absolute Link, Mr. Beardy Face, Iman Lu is it Iman Lula? Is that right? And Noir Pet. I'm gonna go ahead and see what YouTube has in terms of raids for today. It looks like Nia's live. So we're gonna go ahead and raid on over there. She's playing DVD! Anyone wanna get spooked? With some dead by daylight? <laughs> Oh my gosh, but I hope you all had fun tooting along on your trombones. I certainly did. But I'll see you all tomorrow for some comfy, cozy Archangel Radio with my friend Nami. I'll see you all soon. Bye! Bye, bye, bye. Bye, 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 bye. Bye, 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 bye. Bye, 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 bye. Bye 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 bye